Regarding under nerve, I'm going to divide into two parts, motor and sensory. Before I'm going to demonstrate the ulnar nerve test, I would like to recall the muscles that are supplied by the ulnar nerve. The muscle of the forearm. The first muscle is flexor digitorum profundus, the medial part. The second muscle is flexor carpi ulnaris. Muscle of the hand. Cleaner muscles. The first muscle is adductor pollicis. The second muscle is flexor pollicis brevis, the deep part. Hypothenar muscles. The first muscle is abductor digiti minimi. The second muscle is flexor digiti minimi brevis. The third muscle is opponent digiti. Short muscles. The lumbricals. Third till the fourth part. Dorsal interoshi. First till fourth. Palmar interoshi. First till third. And finally, palmaris brevis. So all these muscles are supplied by the ulnar nerve. One of the best way to confirm ulnar nerve injury is weakness or paralysis in adducting the fingers. There are two ways to test ulnar nerve. The first way is to give him a piece of paper and close it with his fingers. The second way is to ask the patient to keep the finger closed while you try to separate them with two of your fingers. One of the typical characteristics of an ulnar nerve injury is a claw hand. Normally, you are able to extend all the fingers, but in the claw hand, you cannot extend fourth and the fifth digit.